Hey Measuring Hero, Jay here. You know, it's been said that truly great products have three different things. Great design, great material, and great craftsmanship. I want to focus on all three of them, but today I want to focus on great material. So I thought we'd come back to our facility in Allen and we can talk about carbon fiber. Let's go do it. Okay, in order for us to explore materials, we're actually going to look at the history of uh, stylus extensions, and in particular for us, we're gonna look at the history of the REACH product. Uh, to help us is Jorg. Jorg, thanks for welcoming us Hello. again into your home. Yes, and I'm thanks happy. Yeah, me too. And thank you for uh, explaining to us about uh, stylus extensions and the REACH product. Yes, hopefully it's, it's, it's very interesting for you. So. Absolutely. So we look right okay. here. Okay. So, in general, I go 25 years ago. Okay. All the machines are in the measuring room mm -hmm. and we use aluminum extensions. Mm -hmm. No problem because uh, in the measuring room, the climate is controlled, right. everything is good, but when the machines start going into the production line, mm -hmm. you have the problem with different temperatures. And aluminum is not really good for temperature. Not very stable. No, but the, the extension itself is not too bad because yep. a thick tube, it's, it's stable, yep. Yep. it's okay, but... It's stiff, but not thermally stable. Really, correct. And 25 years ago, there was... Mm, limited uh, material okay. available yeah. for extensions. So we choose a material, titanium, which is much better in thermal expansion, mm -hmm. but it's double weight. Oh, so it's super heavy and super expensive. <laughs> super expensive, it's more expensive <laughs> than aluminum, but yeah. <laughs> the most problem was the... It's heavy the weight because when you double your existing stylus system mm -hmm. you want that you have the same dimensions mm -hmm. because otherwise you need to change your your measuring program sure sure so but the, the weight on the head yep. is limited yep yep so when we moved from uh, aluminum to titanium we got the benefit of being more thermally stable, but the disadvantage of being heavier, and we couldn't make it bigger, uh, we couldn't make it smaller because we needed to keep the same form factor. And then we started to go with the carbon fiber. And carbon fiber is a really good material. Mm -hmm. Thermal expansion, nothing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So perfect for that. But we need to be better in the deflection mm -hmm. and uh, uh, torsion better than titanium because we had a problem with that. Right, right. So we start developing yep. a kind of waving, weaving that, yep. Yep. Th that material that we have a perfect mm -hmm. bending and torsion. So if I hear you correctly, it wasn't good enough for you to just say, carbon fiber will solve uh, all our woes, uh, you actually went deeper and learned how to weave carbon fiber? Yes, surely, because when we bought our own machine. We because, bought our own carbon yes. fiber weaving machine. <laughs> yes, because you can use carbon fiber tubes for really everything. Yeah. Bicycles or Helmets. whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, but we are not made for metrology. Sure. Ours is especially weaved yeah. for metrology, performance, bending, torsion. Right, right. And what is possible with such machines, I will show you. Look like that. <laughs> That's... It's a styler. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yes, it's a styler. It's a tube and a mm -hmm. sphere, and it was a perfect match for the customers. Sure, sure. So you can custom bend and custom, because we weave our own um, carbon fiber, we can make our own to our specification for sti uh, stiffness. We can create whatever 
shape yes. we want to. Yes, That's yes. Crazy. For example, look like that. It looks heavy. It's heavy. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's for the big machines. My MM notebook set. is heavier. Yes, <laughs> it's for the big machines like MM set. Yeah. Okay, and you, you see, long style eye, mm -hmm. X ray. Fixturing. Fixturing, oh, okay. you okay. see. So range. really, uh, as we evolved through the materials, our ability to make our own brand of met metrology grade carbon fiber opened up our ability to do crazy things or uh, things that don't degrade the quality of the machine. Everything Sentence. that's needed. Everything wow. that's needed yep. to have the real performance of the machine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I will show you, maybe look like, uh, we talked about the thermal stability mm -hmm. and just touch that aluminum and look what happens here. All right, looks like I went immediately, from 20, oh immediately. Gosh. Went from 20 millimeters for that uh, uh, dial indicator to 55. And when I let go, it's not going back. And with the carbon fiber tube, uh -huh. nothing will happen. So it's extremely, so obviously carbon fiber is an upgrade over aluminum, no so, doubt. It's no doubt, yep. it's no doubt. But, but that is possible with every carbon fiber. Mm -hmm. The interesting issue is, just, uh, not just knowing the material, to know what you can do with the material. Mm -hmm. And that is what we did with the REACH portfolio. Okay, Let me show see. you. Different carbon fibers, mm -hmm. different layers, mm -hmm. how much layers and everything. It's really the, 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 the performance of sure. the uh, tube depends on what you are doing with the material. Right. Knowing the right material, right. it's a very expensive here, mm -hmm. a very strong material, here is less strong. Mm -hmm. And just try. Okay, so these are all carbon fiber. No, that is titanium. This is titanium? Just to, just okay. to show okay. against aluminum so is bad. So this was titanium the, and these are different generations of of uh, uh, carbon fiber done in different ways. Yes. It's pretty stiff. This is much stiffer than this than this first one. Well, this one is. It's perfect. <laughs> it's perfect. It's really stiff. So what you're telling me is, even though these are all carbon fiber, they uh, react differently because of the way we take the material, weave them, and we have the control over the material. Even though all carbon, all carbon fiber isn't created equal, is what we're saying. Yes, and that is the, it's carbon fiber tube yeah. is not like carbon fiber tube. Yep. Carbon fiber tube for a bicycle is different to sure. a carbon fiber for maybe a chair or whatever. Yep. yep. And a carbon fiber tube for metrology sure. should be for metrology and should be especially made for metrology. Yeah. So what I'm hearing is at the end of the day, just like we, uh, uh, just like we thought, material matters. It's not just, you know, uh, um, our knowledge and our understanding and application of the material really has an effect on the product uh, performance. So Jörg, thank you for taking the time to, uh, to show this to us. Um, I thought I understood this, but now we have way deeper knowledge. Look, titanium is still, uh, still, still moving. <laughs> so um, uh, at the end of the day, totally material matters. Uh, thanks, Jorg, for uh, taking your time. Um, and for you, hope you enjoy this small little snapshot of materials. Don't forget to stay safe and stay healthy. And we'll see you next Thursday.